Mammals are the largest, and insects are the most annoying. But hands down, reptiles are the most dangerous, terrifying, and sinister animal group on the planet. From crocodiles with jaws powerful enough to snap bones in half, to snakes that can deliver enough venom to take down multiple targets within minutes, and even giant ancient turtles ready to devour anything in their path, including humans. Ready to check them out? Just make sure to keep your distance. Slithering its way onto the record books as one of the most dangerous reptiles, nay, one of the world's most dangerous animals, period, this is the inland taipan. With a venom that is 400 times more powerful and therefore 400 times more deadly than that of a rattlesnake, the inland taipan is widely known as the most toxic land snake on the planet. Can they take out a human? Absolutely! How effective their bite is depends on how much venom enters into our bloodstream. But without an anti-venom within arm's reach, even the smallest drop can be potentially lethal. Thankfully, they tend to live in the hot, dry, remote areas of Australia, where very few people call home. Therefore, they are rarely encountered by humans. Instead, the inland taipan prefers a diet of other, smaller mammals, particularly plague rats. While we have heard stories of people owning inland taipans as pets, rarely does that relationship ever end well, with handlers often left fighting for their life when everything hits the fan. We all know that a raging croc coming at you from the water, jaws ready to snap, is just about the most terrifying sight in the animal kingdom. But what if that crocodile could also climb trees? That's right, the tree crocodile is real, otherwise called the Crocodile Monitor or the Varanus Salvadori if you're after its scientific name. These guys are known for being exceptionally aggressive creatures. Hunters often target them for their meat or their skin, yet you'll find that it's often the Crocodile Monitors who come out victorious typically found across lowland environments near the coast of New Guinea. Tree crocodiles can reach a horrifying 16 feet in length and weigh more than your average human, with nearly 200 pounds being a common sight. Technically, the crocodile monitor is an arboreal lizard. Arboreal meaning tree dwelling, and lizard meaning, well, lizard. It can hang onto branches with its rear legs, and just like a monkey, is able to use its tail as an additional means of grip. As if a giant monkey-crocodile-lizard hybrid wasn't scary enough, to add to the intimidation, they also have long, fang-like upper teeth, which help subdue their prey in an instant. If you ever find yourself gallivanting through the savannas and rocky areas of southern and eastern Africa, you're sure to spot plenty of large animals. Elephants, lions, and buffalo are not uncommon, but make sure to keep your eyes peeled for a particularly sly, particularly deadly reptile, the black mamba. They're capable of growing up to 14 feet long and are capable of scurrying along the ground at up to 12.5 miles per hour. That lightning-fast speed, which is quicker than the average person's running pace, makes the black mamba near impossible to escape. If threatened, watch out. These beautiful yet nasty snakes take down their target with repeated bites. They want to ensure that they've delivered enough venom. Just a single bite carries enough venom to kill 10 humans, so imagine the impact of repeated bites. The only solution, vials of anti-venom, do not come cheap. One summer camper was dealt a bill of $67,957 when she needed four vials after a copperhead bite in April of 2019. And still, a copperhead's venom potency doesn't come anywhere near that of the black mamba. If that same camper didn't receive the correlate of anti-venom within 20 minutes, she would have faced a near 100% chance of fatality. This awkward stone-looking creature might not appear dangerous at first, but ask any fish and they'll certainly tell you otherwise. These unique freshwater turtles, known as the Mata Mata, are typically found throughout South America, in the Amazon and Orinoco basins, spread through Venezuela, Brazil, Peru, Ecuador, Colombia, Bolivia, and the island of Trinidad. With its supreme ability to camouflage, dangerous appetite, and vacuum-like feeding habits, the bottom-feeding Mata Mata will suck up anything and everything in its path. Its shell is rough and knobby, and would be an absolute nightmare to accidentally step on, that's for sure. The impressive shell alone can grow about 1.5 feet and weigh 38 pounds, matching the weight of an average four-year-old child. Unlike most creatures that we've seen thus far, Mata Mata turtles are relatively safe to own as pets. But make sure you're prepared for the commitment. They cost from $500 to $1,000 to buy and will drain hundreds of dollars every year for food. Considering that some turtles can live more than 100 years if given the right care, it adds up to one hefty payout. As we transition over to the volcanic islands of Indonesia, make sure to keep your distance from the Komodo dragon. It might not breathe fire or fly through the air, but the Komodo has a resume as intimidating as any. Sitting at the top of the food chain in their natural habitat, the Varanus komodoensis is the largest species of lizard known today. 
weighing up to 190 pounds and reaching a colossal 10 meters in length. It's not all about size, though, either. These reptiles have a toxic trick up their sleeve. Take a look at those chompers. Not only can they tear into their prey with ease, but they also send an injection of venom into the victim's bloodstream as well. A double whammy. The venom thins the victim's blood and sends them into a state of shock, making escape all the more impossible. While attacks on humans by Komodo dragons are relatively rare, these giant reptiles will do whatever it takes to guarantee their survival if they're threatened. Unlike most animals, they're also capable of self-fertilization and can provide offspring that are absolutely healthy without the need for a partner. When we think of dangerous reptiles, rarely do our minds immediately zero in on turtles. And for the most part, that's justifiable. Turtles are typically slow and docile. Most are peaceful vegetarians that pose no threat to humans. Well, allow us to introduce you to one exception to that rule, the alligator snapping turtle, with a sharp front beak and large robust head shell. These carnivorous reptiles chomp down with a powerful bite force of 1,000 pounds per square inch. That's strong enough to snap through bone, and it's believed that the alligator snapping turtle is easily capable of snapping a broomstick in half. They're not small either. The largest one on record tilted the scales at a whopping 249 pounds, and on average they stretch around 26 inches from beak to tail. Want to own one for yourself? You'll be hard-pressed because these turtles are locally endangered in some states and are absolutely banned in others. As we hop over from the USA to the snake-infested land down under, trust us, there are countless creatures to worry about. Close to 140 species of land snakes slither around across the country, some equipped with venom more toxic than any other serpents worldwide. Of all the frightening reptiles, there is perhaps none more threatening and combative than the Sudanaja textilis, otherwise known as the eastern brown snake. These critters sport a reputation for having a heck of a bad attitude. What's worse, they aren't camped out in the outback away from civilization. Instead, they slither around the outskirts of populated areas, particularly farms on the edge of large cities. If one of these vicious snakes feels threatened, you'll know. It raises its body off the ground, curves itself into an S-shape, like a coiled spring ready to pounce, showing off its wide jaws and piercing fangs. If someone finds themselves in the wrong place at the wrong time without anti-venom at the ready, collapse can occur within just minutes. From the land to the swamps, our next special guest is ready to inflict a world of hurt to anything that crosses its path. We're talking, of course, about none other than the enormous saltwater crocodile. With the exception of the Nile crocodile, no other reptile on Earth even comes close in stature to the saltwater croc. With these colossal carnivores, reaching startling lengths of up to 20.2 feet and tilting the scales at 2,370 pounds. That is almost the same size as a small car. The rows of razor-sharp teeth aren't just for show, they come with a 3,700 pounds per square inch bite force, capable of ripping apart anything and everything in its range. Even though humans aren't typically on the menu, an attack is not unheard of. Believe it or not, in some areas in Australia, you are actually allowed to own a saltwater croc as a pet, although you are required to keep a trauma kit in case of an emergency. Would you be brave enough? On the left is the saltwater crocodile. On the right is the black caiman. Even though they have a long list of similarities, caiman are actually neither alligators nor crocodiles. What they are, however, relentless, sly, and dangerous. Found throughout Bolivia, Brazil, Colombia, Ecuador, French Guiana, Guyana, and Peru, the black caiman establishes itself as the apex predator of its habitat. With a natural ability to grow up to 17 feet and a distinct dark coloration to go with it, to label these reptiles daunting would be an understatement. The caiman is the largest predator in the Amazon River Basin, it presents itself as an excellent swimmer and is as menacing as any of its neighbors. Once their powerful jaws have chomped down and latched onto their prey, it is near impossible to pry them off. Typically, the caiman will feed on fish and other reptiles, but attacks on humans are more common than you might expect. According to the Worldwide Crocodilian Attack Database, black caimans were involved in 43 attacks on people between 2008 and October of 2013. Sometimes it's obvious enormous reptiles that pose a threat, and other times, like in the case of the Russell's Viper, aka the Chain Viper, it's the little guys you've got to be wary of. Exclusive to India, Taiwan, China, and Southeast Asia, the Viper might be small, at just three to five feet, but they are strong, agile, relentless, and come with one of the loudest hisses of all creatures in the reptile kingdom. Here, take a listen. These serpents won't go out of their way to take you down, but they won't back down from a fight either. They tend to roam around open farmland areas, which makes contact with humans very likely. 
A bite from one of these bad boys will cause severe pain that can last up to a month if you make it to that long. Hey, 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 hey! Whoa, 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 whoa! You're all right, mate. Hey, hey. So, which of these reptiles do you find the most intimidating? Let us know in the comments. Don't forget to like this video, subscribe to the channel, and as always, thanks so much for checking out the richest. See you next time. Have a great day. Stay safe.